third. Got to give him a plug. Yes. Because here's is. another great champion. Wants to win his second Firestone. Marshall Holman, 19 titles, including two United States Opens. They call him Magnificent Marshall, and he has definitely earned that praise. All right, he left the seventh pin on the left lane. Very rushed to the line, but it was his first shot. He has that quick style, as you said, Chris, but a very safe shot right there as he sends the ball wide. Doesn't want to go high, as the other players have done on this left-hand lane in the very first frame. Almost gets the strike, but leaves himself a simple spare, the seven pin. Blows in that thumb hole, so we'll get some of that moisture down as it's becoming very warm in this building. It's a capacity crowd watching with you. Sports writers from all over the nation covering this, the great prestigious Firestone Tournament of Champions. And all of us need to thank Mike Connor and Jerry Kern for their help on the part of Firestone. They've been great. And Baker, who has two victories, leaves the 3 6 10. A little upset the way he slid to the line. Sometimes that happens. The approaches get a little tighter as the Humidity and the heat in the building rides, a capacity crowd, and a beautiful day here in Akron as temperatures going up into the 70s. It shouldn't, Mark Baker should not have let that affect him. There's $50,000 at stake and a seven year exemption into this tournament. And that in itself is worth a whole bunch of money. Which is a point where we can say Mike Durbin will be bowling in the Firestone next year because he's won it three times and he has five years more on his last victory. Agreed. The Durbin will be around until he's 50 years old and ready for the seniors tour as you see Baker convert the 3 6 10. All right. The golden boy of professional bowling all even. He's up in the second frame. Leaving a two pin. Pressure. Just a little wide. You're right. Mm. Simple spare for Baker. You can see him starting to breathe very hard. He can feel that victory, feel that pressure. Engaging personality. And so is this man. Charming, very bright. Talks to himself a lot. Don't we all when the heat's on? That's what Marshall wanted. Probably the finest style in the last 20 years in, in all of bowling. Down low, steady head, shoulders level, just scoops that ball off the back of the wrist. A nice snap over the top of the ball. Look at that knee bend. And I'll tell you what, he made those pins talk on this shot. Vintage Holman strike just rips the back end out. Leads by one pin. Third frame strike working. There's the man that wants his 20th title. Maybe he can win. He will. Become only the third man to go over a million dollars in money earned on the tour. And he would be the youngest to do it, Roth and Anthony, the other two. Two power players, and you see the power ball of Holman. He says, take out that 10. Here I come. And for the first time today, we get a look at the four, six, seven, nine, ten. Nelson. Well. What he has to do is get over here in this zone, get over in that 6-10 zone with all that speed and power and hope he can bounce some of those pins around over into the 4-7. Twenty-eight pin difference. Baker with an open in the third. Let's see if he can come back in the fourth. You see Holman has that double up. Style of these two players, these contemporary young players, they can throw so many strikes that 28 pins is not very much at all, and seven frames left in the match. Okay, Mark, 
Baker has won two games, keeping alive here, trailing by 28 now. More after this. Back again at Riviera Lanes, and uh, while we were away, we did not bowl through. <laughs> we had a little housekeeping. Well, what happened is uh, somebody left a rubber mark uh, basically off the heel of their shoe on the approach, and Larry Lichstein, who is our player services director, took a cleaning pad, went up there and just cleaned it off. Everybody's satisfied. They're ready for action now. As Holman comes up here live, leading by 28, a double working, has a chance to extend to 38 with a strike here in the fourth. And it's a two-pin for Marshall, who... Just seemed to keep sliding, Nelson. It looked like he might <laughs> might not stop. Good point, Chris. He likes that uh, that long slide, but not quite that much. As you see the career victories, Marshall Holman would be only the sixth player to win 20 titles in the PBA Tour. Holman conversion here would lead by 27 pins. Oh. <laughs> How costly will that error be? Is there pressure out there? We saw it last year as Bob Hanley was all over the building, could not close the door in the championship matches. Mark Williams went on to win. Once again, pressure affecting both players as Holman misses a very, very simple spare, the two pin. So important after a disaster is open to come back with that perfect pocket hit. Marshall did it. Strike in the fifth frame. Baker now with a strike up in the fourth. Trailing by 15 can cut it to five right here. He stuck at the line. He gets a strike on the left. Chris, he fouled. He slipped right over the line. Did it. The light is on. I'll tell you what. He'll have to. They'll have to go by the ruling now. Now, he can contest this whether he did slip over the line or not, but I think he accepts it. The nice thing about it, if there is a nice thing about it, he had a strike up. And on a strike, you don't lose any pin count. He must throw the second ball as if he threw a ball in the channel on the first shot. There seems to be some confusion among the tournament directors. Called the foul on himself. Now he has to reset himself. What his essence has happened. That foul shot is as good as nine if he can convert the spear. Here you go. You watch Baker. He's down low. Now watch that little spot that they just worked off with the, the smoothing pad. Chris, you noticed it in Holman mm. how far he slid in that zone. Oh, he there did. he is. He's sliding right in that zone. Let's see what happens. That ball comes in. Look at that wrist cup under that hand. And he just slides right over oh, the foul line. Oh, he really line. did. The light goes off. Right now, can Mark Baker salvage a spare? That is pressure, Bowling. That is pressure, ladies and gentlemen. It's the second time his concentration has been broken. In the last match, uh, accidentally, a scissors dropped on the part of the opponent. And uh, looked like Mark was through, but no way. This guy is tough. What a bizarre match so far. Look at the scoreboard. Opens, misses, fouls, everything so far in the first five frames. <laughs> You look at it, it could very well have been a $22,000 shot. And now uh, Marshall Holman uh, makes careful to recheck the slide, and you see this hit. The power of Baker just sawing up all 10 pins, drives that five over in the 4-7 zone. 